Hi guys, my name is Priscilla Fernandez and welcome back to my grandma's channel and today I'm going to be showing you how to do this really nice spring break makeup tutorial. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is clean our face because we don't want our face to be so messy and like dirty when we're doing the makeup because if not the makeup will also look ugly and dirty. So. We're gonna start cleaning our face with this wipe off cream, I'll say, that will make sure our face is nice and clean. And when at the same time we're using that, we're also gonna be using these wipes that are called bamboo carcol. Carcol. And so yeah, first things first, we're gonna open the bottle and we're gonna take out one wipey out. Get the wipe off cream and put it on the wipey. Do about two sprays. And we're gonna go ahead and clean our face. Look how dirty that is. I like this product because it like it really takes out and it goes deep inside your skin to make sure all of that product, just with one wipe, everything is off. We're gonna go get just one little spray that we go inside the eyes, everywhere. We wanna make sure everything is gone for this makeup tutorial. And I'm very excited to show you guys how we're gonna do the spring makeup tutorial okay perfect i took out all the makeup i had in my face so we're gonna put all of this to the side because we're done with it and now we're gonna start with the spring makeup tutorial so we are not gonna put any creams in our face because we already used um, our wipe off and the wipe off comes with oil really nice smooth cream so we're not gonna put oil nothing like that in our face so far because we already used it so before we keep on going we're gonna use our fan to make sure all that wetness in our face goes away so we could make sure we do our makeup right so we're gonna turn on the fan and you're just gonna wait for like 20 or 30 seconds. First things first, we will want to use our concealer from Revell Condit. It is an amazing product concealer. It is amazing, it's very smooth. It even comes with oil as I could see right here. So it's amazing. So, we're also going to be using a little brush that is also pretty cool too. First, we're going to add the concealer on our eyelid first, both eyes. Okay, now that I have the concealer in my eyes, now we want to make it scrub it. What you could use is your finger or a brush. Any way is amazing. You could use any, your finger or your brush. So I'm gonna be using the brush first. I really like if you make it go in circles just to blend it in more. Now I want to go in with my fingers. Now to, you can see I can still have a little bit of concealer there, but it's gonna make it better when you bl blend it in with your fingers. Mm -hmm. 
We're going to go in circles too with our finger like this. Like that, it's awesome. Now we're going to go in with the other eye. Perfect. Now that we're done with the concealer, we are also going to put that onto the side. And now it's time for the eyes. Ooh, I love the eyes. I don't know, they're like my favorite thing from makeup. So for eyes, we're going to be using this palette that is called Anthem. I really like this palette. And the product, it is made with wood. And the colors that it comes with is pale gold, copper, P1 brown and M1 brown. But the colors that we are gonna be using is pale gold and copper. And we're gonna be using this one and this one. And you're gonna put it near your eyebrow And you're also gonna put it in the corner of your eye just to make it pop a little. And do the same thing on the other side. So now we're gonna be using this copper color right here. We're gonna be using this copper color and we're gonna put it under the color that we did before this color. And do the same for the other eye. Okay, now that that is done, we're going to go in with a brown eyeliner. And it's from the same company as the eyeshadow that we use to put in our eyelids. Anthem. And it's an amazing product too. It also comes with, it's really smooth to put in your eye. It's not hard. So instead of doing a cat eye, like almost all videos do, we're just gonna put it under our eyelashes, under your eye right here. So that's how it's gonna look like. And I'm gonna do the same thing with the other eye. Okay, so what this would do, is gonna bring your eyes more pop and more bigger. So now we're going to go back with the same concealer we used to put on top of our lids. The same one. So now we're going to go in with the same concealer we used to put in our, in our lid. We're going to put it under our eyes. And now we're going to use this brush to blend it in. Okay. 
While you are doing this, you could just do little loops like this. Until it just blends it all in. Then you're going to get a sponge to blend it in more. So like it really wouldn't see that you're wearing makeup. So you could look like, dang, you young. <laughs> okay. Okay, now that we're really done blending the concealer in my eyes, we are gonna go on to our foundation. So, this is not really a foundation, but I'll say it is. It is really a moisturizer, but this moisturizer has color in it that acts like if it was a foundation. And, and it's from Algenis. It's a super good product and the color is Son Tente. And I'm really, really happy to use this. And it has a lot of good stuff for your skin. It has this really good oil and all of that. This is super good for your skin. And it makes your skin smooth too. So we're gonna go ahead and put it on this little plate. Hold on, let me first shake it. Okay, we're gonna take it out. And don't add that much to your face. Because if not, it's going to go a little bit too shine. Because this color means it shines. And it's like, um, I don't know, like it shines. And this is how much product I'm going to be using. And if it runs out, I can maybe use just a little bit. And the brush we'll be using is this nice brush. All of the brushes that I'm using for this tutorial is from the same company. It's from Real Tenkins. We're gonna go ahead and just dip in like this. Like this, nothing. And we're gonna go ahead and put it all over. So one here, one here, one here, one here, one here, and one here. Perfect. Now we're just gonna go ahead and blend it in. And this is a really nice, smooth product. I really, really like this. You're gonna see my skin is gonna night. It's gonna sh gonna glow. It's gonna be like a nice sunset. So now I just need a little more for the rest of my face, and we're just gonna go in circles to blend in that nice beautiful face i have and that everyone has i'm gonna go down here that i'm still missing Now that that is done, we're going to go ahead with our sponge and we're going to go ahead and blend it in more. Don't go that hard to your face. It will hurt, so just go like a dip, like a dip like that. Now that we're done with our foundation, it is time to go to our contour. So here I go, getting my contour. And the palette that we're going to be using for the contour is 
the two faced. So we're gonna open it. And the side that we are going to be using is the, the darker color, which is in this side. And the product has also has oil for your skin, which is super good. It's gonna make your skin healthy. And the brush that we're gonna be using is this brush. And now we're just gonna go in with our ear all the way to your cheekbone up to here. And the same thing, ear to nose. Now, we're gonna go in for our nose. For our nose, we're gonna use this brush that's more like a, I don't know, more shaped. We're just gonna do the edges. And what this is gonna do is gonna make our nose smaller. So it's technically the edge of your eyebrow, then down. Then you're gonna get our sponge and we're gonna just blend that in, blend that girl in. So for our blush, we're gonna be using this Revolution Heart. So, and we're gonna be using this brush, same company as the other brushes. And we're gonna be using this side of the palette, not this side, this side. And we're gonna add it where our cheekbone is. We could also add a little bit to our nose. And a little trick to make your nose cuter, you're gonna get a little bit of the blush on the tip of your finger. And you add a little tip to your nose just to make that baby shine. Amazing! Now that that is done, we're gonna go on to our lips. For our lips, we are going to use this Beauty Treats Lip Care first. And the lip is Sweet Almond. We're gonna put a little bit on our finger. So now, we're gonna be using a lip glow from the company Nakar Makeup. And this company is from my aunt, Natalia. So she's also a makeup artist just like my mom and grandma. And she has her own company. And she made this really nice glow lipstick. And it's also like a spicy lip. I don't know. It makes your, it also makes your lips go a little bit spicy, but it's super good. And it also smells good. And this is the final product. We're gonna go ahead and I'll be come back with the results. So now I'm gonna put on these really nice earrings that are from Character Club and they're also from my grandma. So I'm gonna be putting them on.
Okay guys, so this is the final product and I hope you guys follow the video and this is a really good makeup because you could use it in any event. You could use it in spring, the summer, anywhere because this is a makeup, it's very natural. It's amazing. Bye, see you in the next makeup tutorial in, of course, here, my grandma's studio. Mm -hmm. Bye.